Welcome one and all. Welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. Okay, straight into it. Jeez. Our beloved Galar region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Is it Galar? Galar? It's Galar. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon in which we share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. Awkward pause. With an elephant. <laughs> Thanks to the help from these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon are all around us in the sea, in the sky, and even with us in our towns. You're a little bit slow. I can talk faster than you. There we go. And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete, we call Pokemon Trainers. It's me. I'm that guy. Wait, did I choose a guy? I'm not sure. Oh, I'm getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Rose. Hmm, didn't see that coming. And it's a pleasure to be here. Now turn your gaze to the Galar's region, or Galar's re <laughs> region's greatest Pokemon trainer, your undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Leon's Exhibition Match. Classic Leon. Love to them, Resident Evil. Um, I like his hair. And Charizard, I really like Charizard. He looks like he's just the bigger space gem. I don't even know what Pokemon that is. Exhibition or not, Leon, your pristine record is about to... Oh, you know I don't lose battles, <laughs> battles Ryan. <laughs> it changed so quickly. I, I guess I don't need to read anymore, do I? Oh no. That's one big Charizard. It's gotta be said. Pokemon Shield. Hello guys, and welcome to Pokemon Shield. That was a pretty cool intro. Pretty epic straight to a sheep, which I'm very, very excited about. <laughs> um, oh wow, this looks really good. I don't know why I'm surprised, but it just really looks better than I expected. Oh, he's snoozing. Oh, and there's me on my switch, probably. My Pokédex switch. Hello, hello! Is that your new f wait? Oh, that your flash new phone, huh, Jordan? That your flash new phone. That your flash new phone. I don't think that's proper English. Just, just gonna say. Were you watching Lee's exhibition match on it? But you can't cheer him on with your hands full. <laughs> you know the only way to properly cheer on Lee would be with his famous Charizard pose. Charizard. Uh, Mum. Hop, oh, didn't expect you to see you today, dear. Isn't this the big day? Yeah, that's exactly why I came running over to get Jordan. Never mind, uh, never mind watching the match now. I've got it recording my home anyways. I'll record my brother's. I record all my brother's matches. Ah, that makes sense with the hair. I see that. Come with me, Jordan. He should be here any minute. And Lee always brings present when he visits, so I wouldn't forget that bag if I were you. Okie dokie. What bag? Now I've got to run. See you at mine later. Okay, that was that was English. I understood that one. I like how I said nothing. I just sat here. Can I move? Oh. Oh, wow. Oh. Oh. I'm so... F I don't have to run everywhere. Oh, jeez. I'm fast. Though. Look at that. Um, okay. First thing I always do in Pokemon games. It's a television that mom uses to watch her comedy dramas. Wait. You used to always be able to turn on the TV. It's a fireplace built into the house that keeps things warm in the harshest winter. I like the very specific, uh, much like sleep leftovers around. <laughs> it's a bed from time to time. Awesome. There's lots of books and magazines about Pokemon neatly lined up. But anyways, since I haven't had a good time to say anything, hello, welcome <laughs> to Pokemon Shield as I move my microphone it makes a loud noise. Uh, I'm playing this because, well, I wanted to. I love Pokemon. But also, uh, I chose Shield because Zach uh, Scott Games uh, is playing Pokemon Sword. So if you want to check that one out, go over there. But I figured I'd play the opposite. And also, I'd be able to help him with Pokemon if the time came. And yes, I'm using trying the 
webcam thing, so if it's hopefully not blocking anything, uh, I'll see, but I think I put it in the best spot, so hopefully that's all good. Now, what are you up to? What do you have to say for yourself? Oh. Oh, he's the best thing in the world. We need to protect him at all costs. Alright. Um, Mum. Hello, Mother. Rushing off in uh, that state, Jordan. Didn't Hop say you should bring your bag? Last I saw it in your room, and don't forget to grab a hat for the weather. Is it sunny out or... Wow. I don't have a lot of privacy, do I? <laughs> you grabbed your dad's old bag. Where is my dad? Oh. In fact, you never see your dad in like, any of the Pokemon games, do you? <laughs> I'm fairly certain. I don't know. Alright. Adventure Guide. Open the X menu by pressing the X button. That makes sense. Uh, you can uh, save your progress by selecting save from the X menu. Uh, which one's the X one? Okay, the top button. Where Y usually is, that makes sense. Uh, you can, So you can save, you can also check your location uh, and your next destination by selecting the town map. And you can check this adventure guide anytime you want the key item selection in your bag. Okay. So yeah, press that. Now I can save, which I'll go ahead and do. Just so I don't have to do the intro again, I guess. And, uh, so if I press that, okay, so, yeah, town map. Ooh, this is nice. So I guess, I guess that's that nice route there. So Postwick, so yeah, I just gotta go outside for the next thing, that's, that's fair. I meant to press B, but it's not the normal B. You know, it's a hard life. Can I get in bed? No, okay. Uh, should I say goodbye or anything? Oh, don't you look a treat. I know that bag would suit you. Now hurry along. Hop is waiting, isn't he? But remember, no going into that forest, the two of you. Yep, never done that in a Pokemon game. Uh, <laughs> we would never. We're good boys. You gotta believe. Oh, so much darker now. My face just got, like, so much darker. Uh, better. Oh, my God. I live in, like, the nicest, like cottage in the world to have like thatch roofing and oh whoa oh hello be mine forever okay bye bye cute cute thing uh <laughs> have a look at you jordan <laughs> that's my name <laughs> that old bag looks like it could pull you over at least we know that it should hold anything lee might bring it, even if it's as big as a snorlax what that's just rude to snorlax <laughs> dumb sheep a wooloo but what is it doing there? <laughs> Wooloo. <laughs> hey, you silly Wooloo. I see what you're up to. Don't go using tackle on the fencing. Now you listen. No, getting pet no going past that fence. No. Everyone knows the scary Pokemon living in the slubber slumbering wild. Wild? Wild? I'm gonna say wild. Meh. <laughs> Do you like that voice acting? That's good. Now that's taken care of. How about it, Jordan? Let's race back and make it to my house first. What with you lugging that big old bag? Well, yeah, I'm not gonna win. I mean, I don't even know where I'm going yet. Okay, now I can move ten minutes later after he was allowed to already go. Makes sense to me. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Is this where his house is? Is this your house? I guess you would go in the front door, wouldn't you? <laughs> that would make sense, wouldn't it? Hello! Random stranger's house, or his house? His house, okay, good. <laughs> That's good to know, at least. Mom, is he here? There you are at last, Top. Oh, and you brought along Jordan. Hello, dear. Yeah, 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 but where's Lee? <laughs> Have you got him crammed in the cupboard? He's still not here yet for the hundredth time, honestly. Hop, you must learn some patience. He's probably only just arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. Then that's where I'm going. Uh, you know Lee is hopeless with directions. I'll make sure he doesn't get lost on the way. Oh, will you? Yes, it's probably for the best. You've got to come, Jordan. You still never met my big bro, right? You can't miss out your chance to meet the undefeated champion. I'll wait for you on the route. Why can't we just walk together, you know? That would make more sense. Let me talk to her, see what she's saying. Go on with Hop and pick up Leon, won't you, Jordan? I know you're the reliable sort. Yeah. I'll have everything ready for a barbecue in the garden when you're all back. Oh, okay. You're speaking my language now. There was a weird cat back there. I saw that. Um. <laughs> Alright. Where are we headed? Yum. Oh, there we go. Mm. 
Oh. What? Why the epic music suddenly? Let's get a move on. Only remember, Jordan. Wild Pokemon could come out of nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass. I've got my woohoo with me, so I'm ready to battle against wild Pokemon, of course. But not you, Jordan, so we'll still clear the tall grass as we go. <laughs> There's a lot more reading in this. I kind of forgot. That it's all reading. Although I don't think I would ever want it to be voice acted, so that's fine. Right, see you later. Well, I guess I probably should talk to you. Let's go and meet Lee at the station. Stay ahead from here. It's kind of weird we don't walk together. <laughs> it just, just kind of stays over there. Oh, there's Charizard. <laughs> nice cape. What a victory pose, you know? <laughs> That's how I meet everyone that I see. Just straight into a pose. Hello, hello, Wedgeworst. Wedgeworst. Wedgehurst. There we go, I got there in the end. Your champion, Leon, is back. Oh, yes. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for all you to watch. It's our unbeatable champion, Leon, and Charizard are the greatest. Oh, you and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. I hope you'll you'll all carry on training up your Pokemon and never shy from battle. Then come challenge me for the champion title. We're on it. We've all been working on our battle skills, just like you taught us to me. Heck yeah. But that Charizard is yours of yours is too strong for the likes of us to take on. Well yeah. Too true that Charizard is blazingly strong, but other Pokemon can be strong as well. That's why I want the strongest of challengers to fill the gym challenge and battle me. My wish is for Galar's trainers to work together and become the strongest in all the world. Quar. That's what Charizard sounds like. Lee! Up. So my number one fan in the world has come out of his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly an inch and a quarter since the last time I saw you. Bingo, that's the sound of sorry sharp about it. It's kept you undefeated for so long, eh, Lee? <laughs> and he's brought us over here. You got it. You must be Jordan, am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Garlori's region's greatest ever Pokemon champion and a massive Charizard fan, too. People call me the unbeatable Leon. I'm gonna call you guy in tots with football shorts um, and like a rugby jersey with sweatbands and a cape. That's what we'll call you. Come on, Lee, and you, Jordan. <laughs> Bet I can beat the both of you back home. All right, that hop always wanted to be the best, isn't he? With a proper rival of his own, I bet he'll push himself to become something truly special. A rival, eh? Well, everyone, I bid you farewell for today, but don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Galar can have champion time. Like a sponsored cape. <laughs> we all have sponsored capes, right? I like how Charizard said, okay, there he goes. I was like, I like how he's just stayed behind. Just like, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> Come on, Leon, you promised us a present, so out with it. You brought Jordan and me a, a Pokemon. You did, didn't you? You know, you must have. Right then, the greatest gift from the greatest champion. It's showtime, everyone. <laughs> so much reading. I kind of forget that that's, you know, a big part of, you know, Pokemon in general. I'll move my lot over a little bit. There we go. Oh, that's some Pokemans. Grass-type Pokemon, Grookey. Fire-type Pokemon, Scorbunny. And the Water-type Pokemon, Sobble. Oh. They're all cute. Fire Boy. I don't actually know who I want. I, I usually always go the fire route, but I could always try something new. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Got him. Oh. Oh no. I love him. I'm tempted to try water top, actually. Alright, line up everyone. <laughs> Hmm, water top could be fun actually. And Zach is using the bunny. So I mean <laughs> I mean it won't be the worst. 
And if a water boy, I could take out his Charizard eventually, you know? Go on, you pick first. I got already got my Wooloo after all. Wooloo. Let's, let's, let's see. What was your name again? This is the water top Sobble. It adapts to anything surely as water flows. I'm going with a water top Pokemon Sobble? Yeah, I feel good with that one. You chose Sobble. I did. Would you like to give Sobble a nickname? Uh, no, I'm okay with I, I like the regular names. Sobble has been added to your party. Woo. Aw, look at him. We're best friends. I can't take any time to drink. So it'll be Sobble for you. Nice one. Then I'll go with Score Bunny. You're mine. Aww. I'm aiming to be the next champion, so be ready. You and I will be doing some serious training. Oh, <laughs> he's cute. <laughs> Him and Wooloo just having a good time, you know? I bet you will be Hop. That's why I brought along his Pokemons for you and Jordan. Pokemons. <laughs> Pokemans. So the two of you can battle and train and grow. That's a bit of a weird one. Battle and train and grow. Just say battle, train and grow. Stronger together and try to try to reach me. Poor little guy. And you'll come with me. Oh, thank you. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict but strong and real kind too. Okay, cool. He's happy about it. At least I got sad. All right, enough of this trainer nonsense for one night. Dinner's ready, children. Bring along your Pokemon and let's eat. Oh, food. I'm like a shadow on my face. Where's that coming from? <laughs> What's that, like kebabs? <laughs> I think it's exactly what it is. Not sure what noise that was. The next day. You spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right, Hop? The two of you getting all right, on all right, understanding one another? Maybe you can build up a bit of love? Of course I have, Lee. Jordan's made best friends with his Sobble, too. Sobble. Then listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. If you trust in one another, carrying on and carry on battling side by side for long enough, then someday you might even become worthy rivals for me, the unbeatable champ. Why are you looking at him? Wait. What are you looking at him for, Lee? I'm the one who will be coming to challenge you. If you think that Jordan might be able to challenge you, then I guess he's my first rival. But I'm not playing on to lose him and... But I'm not playing to lose him and miss all my chance to beat the unbeatable champ. Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. Proper trainers raise the Pokemon up to be you first rate in battle, too. Oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself a proper trainer already? Hop. Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend if he's up for it. <laughs> what do you say, willing to take and ready to take Hop on the first ever Pokemon of your life? Pokemon battle of your life? And believe in your Pokemon and care for them too with all your hearts. Do those things I'm certain you'll learn to choose moves that suit your Pokemon and more importantly, to have a champion time battling them. <laughs> uh, so much reading. Looks like everyone's on board, Pokemon Trace Light. Let's do this. I've watched every match that Lee's ever had, and I've read every book and magazine he left behind at home, too. I know exactly what to do in order to win. Yep. <laughs> You're challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hop. Hopscotch. Alright, I forget I have to face Lee. Alright. Got two partners with me. Yeah, I mean you kind of, you, you kind of cheating there, really. All right, let's uh, yeah, let's go straight for pounds, you know. And I'm not, not sure how lucky I'll get here. I mean, I'm just gonna use pound over and over. Maybe I'll get like a critical hit or something. Here. Uh, but I mean, it's kind of, kind of the best I got here. I'm not gonna like really use growl right now. <laughs> not this early on. Alright. Wooloo is down. I gained experience points. And I leveled up to six. Which, wait, doesn't that restore my health as well? And I learned water gun. I see what they're doing here. <laughs> water, fire, water gun. Yeah. <laughs> it's 
uh, it's going to be bad for him. All right, water gun. This is going to be probably like take half his health, I'd imagine. Yeah, over half. Super effective. Did you already know about top advantages? I did, yes. <laughs> this is true, I did. I've played a Pokemon game or two in my time. And uh, that's a win for me. <laughs> and he's famous. Night, night. Pokemon game to XP points. Is that another level up? Yeah, level seven. Wow, that was quick. I know in the newer games it doesn't take quite as long as before. Defeated. You beat two, my two Pokemon with your one? You and that Sobo are too much. Got 400 whatever for winning. Wow. <laughs> well, that was a shock. Guess I know why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon too. You and your Pokemon all fought hard. Made me almost want to let out Charizard and join in all the fun. Good effort out there, Sobo. Why don't uh, I get you all sorted? Guess, yeah, healing up. And Jordan, you've got real promise. In fact, I have a favor to ask you. Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Push him and make both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. You've seen me in battle. Now let's come on. you got to let me take on the Pokemon gyms. You? Join the gym challenge? You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region? Not putting in the cart before rapid the Rapidash there, little brother. Not putting the cart before the Rapidash there, little brother. Sure. <laughs> If that's really what you want to do, you have a whole lot you need to learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend Jordan. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. Oh, so there's the Pokedex. A trainer's Pokedex helps them learn lots of things about Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than just a collection of data you know. It's a record of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. Right, right, we get it. Pokedex is them. We're on it. Looks like we're off to the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, Jordan. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to expect you. I'm going to be the next champion, so completing a little Pokédex will be nothing. Just another page in the tale of my legend. You'd probably better go tell your mum that we're heading out, though. Yeah, I'm sure that's fine. <laughs> All right, mum, here I come. Oh my god! I must say that the woo, woo just went to the fence, didn't he? Jordan, did you hear that just now? The gate's open, and the Wooloo that was there. Uh-oh. It was tackling that fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through there? No, nah, the fence is just broken open, and he was tackling it for forever. Couldn't be. But it's off limits. No one's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once, and she came back in a real state. And that was nothing compared to the air force she got from the professor afterwards. Jordan, what do you say? Um, I don't know. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if I want to just go. I mean, yeah, I do do want to go in. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, I did want to go in, but I didn't want to be the, the one who said I was going in. Can I just... <laughs> I was like, can I just not? Uh, okay. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Slumbering welt. We held. Beautiful. Oh. I've been talking straight for the last 30 minutes. Ooh. That Wooloo, where do you think it got off to? Uh, I'll probably somewhere in the woods. The fog is really coming on thick now. If we don't find that Pokemon soon, we might be in trouble. By the way, I just totally like fill in my own <laughs> words sometimes. I know a lot of it does seem to say that, but. And we automatically ran into the cutest squirrel I've ever seen in my life. Oh my God, I love it. Why don't I have Pokeballs? Uh, probably pounds. Should take it out in like one hit, honestly. Should take it out in like two hits, honestly. Tail whip. The most deadly of whips. Oh no. My defense. Pound. <laughs> and done. Yeah. This game doesn't really aid to so far in the beginning to like let me talk a lot, but... Thank you for being here. And all the good stuff. Um, plan to go for like an hour here. It's just, uh, first like 30 minutes of it, it's just a lot of, a lot of uh, waiting for things to kind of go there. Uh, oh. Well, that was nice and easy. Uh, 
Okay, so yeah, we got more grass. Oh, ran into someone else. Who do we got? You've encountered a wild, wild root, root, rookity? Rookity? I guess rookity? These are like all new Pokemon, I think. Or at least I don't recognize them. It's been a little bit, like, kind of hot single since I've played the Pokemon game there properly. I didn't really play too much of the last, like, probably two that came out. I just pinned. I didn't do much, but it worked. Alright. Got more EXP, which is grand, though. Uh, okay. I like how I'm trying to avoid it, but in reality, it's like, oh, fine. Did you hear that? Was that a Pokemon crying out, do you think? Probably not. Oh. <laughs> oh, back to the old Squizzle. The Squavit. Squavit. Alright, Sobble and Squavit. Uh, so, oh, it actually tells you what's effective once you use it. Oh, that's weird. Has it been that before or is that new? It's probably new. Alright. Shakes his tail feathers, even though he doesn't have feathers, but still, whatever, it's a squirrel. Um, it's actually, it says effective, so I'm curious how effective. Um, not very. Not as much as I think just using the water gun would have been. Alright, so we'll use pound again. That should at least take it out now. Close, but got there in the end, so that's fun. Alright. XP points plus 19. It's so beautiful. Alright, a little hairy to take a second break in. Crazy noises. Come on, Jordan, that Wooloo might be in real trouble. Yeah, run first. I'm sure that's going to go well. Uh. <laughs> I was expecting to just hear him scream like that. Ooh, it's a wee bit foggy. Yeah, I can see perfectly. This is mad I can't even see my hand in front of my face. Uh, I think now I get why this place is off limits. Maybe, just maybe. Oh. Well, this isn't great, is it? Oh, hello. What the? It's, uh, greed. <laughs> um, wow. Didn't realize you just kind of see this, like, instantly in the beginning of the game. Don't worry, I got this. This will be easy. Water gun. Easy. Um, what the? Or what? The move had no effect on him. Uh, you know, I'm just gonna say run. You can't run away for some reason. Okay, that's good. Pound. <laughs> the move had no effect. Oh. Oh lord. You know, this is a real, a real time. Jordan, I can't see anything. You okay? Can growl at him, maybe. That'll really show him who's boss. The growl always gets him. <laughs> Move had no effect. Oh. Oh, that's a wide out. Oh, boy. I can't see anything. I see what? You, you, why? <laughs> oh, I like the translation of noises. It's beautiful. the huge shadow I have across my face. <laughs> Hop! Jordan! Oh. We aren't here, don't worry about it. What? Lee, how'd you manage to find your way here? Your pants with the directions, you always get lost. Well, that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you two and you never showed. Of course I came looking for you both. Where's the Wooloo? We were trying to rescue that Wooloo. Oh. Oh. Charizard and the sheep best friends. Oh. Oh yeah, we were all fainted. 
Uh, but to encourage to come here all the same, and I can't understand well enough why you did it. Or I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. And at least we lose all right. Yeah, Jordan? I thought we'd had it when a weird fog started and rolling in that mad Pokemon attacked. But at least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon. What are you talking about, Hop? It seemed low stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. It just had this sort of presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really, they seemed to pass right through it. Our moves passed right through it. So the fearsome Pokemon, if they say they live in the stumbling, slumbering wheel, <laughs> are they actually illusions or something? Get strong enough and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth one day. Just maybe. Uh, you'll be all, all right now that I'm here with you. I believe it. Even if we did get an earful, earful from Lee, one experience, this will be a pretty fun first page of the Tell him a Legend. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't really an earful. It was quite nice, honestly. Don't forget to tell your mom we're off to Wedgehurst now. Uh, she'll go spare if you leave without word. Even worse than just leave. Just did. I skipped on it. I forgot what I said. Post week. Uh, where's my house? <laughs> it's this way. <laughs> it started me on the bridge, so I kind of assumed that it was like the other way. But no. We're good. They're so cute. Uh... Hello, mother. Wah. Well, if... Well, now. Isn't Swabble, Swabble just a sweetheart? And yes, I heard the news from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, aren't you? That's exactly what she sounds like. Here we are. A bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself a little something at the Pokemon Serum. Maybe some potions or something. Remember that Swabble will battle to the very end for you. So don't go pushing the poor deer too hard. Wah. And you, Sabo, look after my little Jordan. I'm not little. Come home and rest any time that you need. After all, east or west, home is best. <laughs> I'm out of here, Mom. Hold me back. <laughs> Alright. We're off to Wedgehurst. Which I'm guessing is the German-looking town <laughs> right up ahead. Just maybe, though. I see you there. I'm out of here. Oh. Here we go. This is quite a big step, you know. My first step become toward becoming the next champion. Guess I'll probably train up Score Bunny a bit by having a battle against Pokemon in the tall grass. You should get yourself to the building with the purple roof and the great red and white ball. Uh, oh, mark out on front. That's the Pokemon Research Lab. All right. I guess I can, so I can get my Pokédex and then get on to where I need to be. But it is blocked there, so something tells me I might need to go through here. Maybe. And encounter the wild squavit. Squavit. Uh, so. I think this is much more effective, so I'm gonna use this. I'm guessing once I get to level. Probably like 9, I'll be able to just take a long like one hit at this point. Critical hit. How dare you. So I don't have any. Like balls or anything to it. Oh, I have a Pokeball. I don't know if he's low enough. No, he's definitely not lower. I don't know why I threw that. I wanted to cancel it so I could hit him with a pound, but I don't know, I might get lucky. Probably not. Oh, I actually got him. So I got a squab it. Awesome. I didn't expect to get him at that. Like he was only at like half health. Gain experience points. So there we go. We're a two party team now. Amazingly so. Would you like to give Squavit a nickname? Uh no. I would call him Ricky, but we're fine for now. Ooh, there's the little owl. Oh, so you can't actually kind of see what's in the grass? Things like, I guess, will come after you? Oh, found a potion. I want whatever this is. <laughs> it looks cute. <gasps> you encountered a wild nicket. It's the cutest thing I've seen in my life, just saying. Um, I must have that to a lot of things, but please don't kill it one hit. I will cry. Please, this will kill it. Oh, okay. I thought that would kill him for some reason. Uh, let me see if I can hit it with Pound without taking it out, hopefully. I mean, if there's one there, it'll be more, maybe. Um, but we'll see. Because if I can... Oh, Lord, that was close. Nah, I didn't mean to do that. I wanted to go to my bag, and then I want to catch it. Huh? 
<laughs> I think it was caught. That's great. So we have like a the cutest fox thing in the world. Squabble grew Lou Sobble. I keep on saying squabble. Sobble grew to level eight. Sobble learned bond. Whatever that would be. I don't remember bond, but uh, no nickname for now. Been added to your party. Uh, do I want one of those? Eh, nah, that'll be fun. <laughs> oh, I do want that though. I'll scratch my nose. Uh, Paralyzed Heal Spray Type Medicine for Treating Paralysis. Par par paralysis. There we go. My brain couldn't remember how to say that word for saying. I was like, I know how to say this. Ooh. Ha. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, there's old Charizard. So the champion's here. Yep, that's me in the future. Oh, hello. Well done. You've reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon Research Lab. Oh, Charizard. You did a far sight better than I did my first time. I'm hopeless with directions. See how your world has already grown? All thanks to having Pokemon with you? I'm sure I've got it. I'm sure glad that I've got Charizard with me to keep me from getting lost all the time. Now, in we go. Grrr. Oh. Oh, what a nice place. Is Professor Oak still thing? Oh no. I've got to give it to Professor Magnolia. Everything in here looks fantastic. Or fan. What did it say? <laughs> I did actually read. I skipped on accident. Oh. Is that a. It's, it's, well, no, that, that can't, that can't be a Pokemon. What is it today, Leon? Looking for another never before seen super strong Pokemon? I wish you stopped with these outlandish requests. I'm, I'm gonna need whatever Pokemon that is. And then that's my main Pokemon. There's no other Pokemon except that Pokemon. Good to see you too, Yamper. Oh, Yamper. Emperor here is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost on the road. Oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonia. 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 I don't know. Uh, what can I say about her? Uh, well, I like the way she cooks. Uh, she makes food you can gobble down in a flash. What kind of introduction is that? Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? Uh, it wasn't just Yamper helping you out. I did too. But Yamper... Let's talk a little more about him. Anyways, nice to meet you. My name's Sonia. Sonia? I'm gonna say Sonia. Sonia. <laughs> I'm the professor's assistant. This is Jordan. He is a new Pokemon trainer. Set him uh, on the right path, would you? And then give me Yamper. That's all I truly need. Ugh. <sighs> Who does he think I am? He's always got his head in the clouds. No wonder he gets lost all the time. I already know what she was going to say. Didn't have to press A. Oh, it looks like you got a Rotom phone. What is a Rotom phone? Hi there, Rotom. Oh. What? <laughs> Rotom phones are handy th things, aren't they? They've got a map and a navigation tool. That said, Leon still gets lost, so... Oh, sorry. So do tell me. Do you know a lot about Pokemon? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm genius. Well said. In that case, I'll make sure that you can use the Pokedex on your Rotom phone. Oh, so it's like an app. <laughs> Basically. Uh, just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my Gran. Could you let Gran know that you received the Pokedex? She lives in the house down along Route 2. Oh, hiccup. Ow. Alright. Here I'm coming, Gran. <sighs> Yamp. Can I pet you? I need to pet you. You don't understand. Uh, hey there, Drenda, sorry to stop you. You just left the Pokemon uh, lab, right? So that means you got a Pokedex, a Pokedex, yeah? I love talking to trainers and giving them useful stuff. You obtained a potion. Oh, sweet. You put the potion in the bag's medicine pocket. It's a potion you use it when your Pokemon's HP, their hit points, gets low. HP is like a Pokemon's stamina. You can even use potions during battle. Knowledge is power, and a good idea to talk to lots of different people to read everything that you can on your journey. This is very true. I don't do it much anymore, but <laughs> this is very true. It's very helpful. Um, so along Route 2, which I guess I could look at... Oh, that was the wait, mystery gift. Get a mystery gift. 
Wait, take a stroll with Pokeball Plus. Oh god. It's gonna be something we'll have to buy, isn't it? Get via local communication, get via internet. Yeah, get via internet. You will now connect to like, yeah. <laughs> I'm curious. Interesting. But this is fun so far. The graphics are really fun. I like how everything looks. Um, and it's really inter like, interesting, like the difference. Uh, Giga, Gig Entamax Meowth Gift. What does that mean? Oh, loot box. <laughs> I'm very confused what's happening here. Mouth's data will be added to the Pokédex. Galarian Mouth. Wait, I just got a Meowth? But what? <laughs> Does this happen often? Place a Pokémon in your Pokéball Plus and go take Pokémons for a stroll. The more you all can play with your Pokémon, the better rewards you get in return. Press the top button on the control stick on your Pokemon Plus, then wait till it connects with your game. Okay, I don't have that, but that's interesting. Um, okay, a lot is very different than I remember. Uh, <laughs> interesting. So, town map. Uh, so, yeah, that's Route 2. So, I'm guessing I need to hit somewhere. Oh, it even says, so there's Pokemon Center, Berry Grocer, Boutique, Wedge, Hearst Station, and Pokemon Research Lab. Route 2 is, I guess, just don't know yet. Uh, wait, what do you want me to do? Did it say go to the Poke Center? Pop into the Pokemon Center. I like that. It has like a little nice... Uh, oh, there it is. It has a nice little way of telling you kind of what to do now, which is, you know, kind of rare. Oh, got your Pokedex from Sonia. Then it's time to meet lots of different Pokemon and start building up a strong team. But battling strong Pokemon in the wild can leave your team in a bad way, not to mention what battling another trainer can do. Luckily, we got Pokemon Centers. Uh, lucky you yet, they're dead easy to spot. They look the same wherever you go. Come on, join, but you never seen an inside one. Just make my own words. Works out well enough. Alright. Hello. Level with me, Jordan. Is this the first time in a Pokemon Center? Of course not. Then I don't think you need to tell me what you already know. Yep. If you two kids are in Pokemon trades, you might want to buy some potions before you head out. Cheers, I'm already good though. I'm heading in a route to Jordan. Come find me, and maybe when you're done here. Wait, everything's in one building now? <sighs> That's pretty great, actually. Hello, and welcome to the Pokemon Center. Would you like to rest your Pokemon? No. Yes. Uh, guess I think I need to rest the ones that are recently unlocked. And I have Meowth now for some reason, which is stupid, but I love it. <laughs> I'm like, okay, right. I'm very happy. Um, we hope to see you again. I mean, you will. I have to. Um, hello. Got some Pokemon questions, feel free to ask. Rate a nickname, remember a move, forget a move. Nah, I'm good. Um, I guess the Pokemart. I'm here to buy. What do you got? Show me what you got. Um, I mean, I guess I'll get another, like... I'll get, like, one potion just to be, like, I bought one. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Alright. Uh, that's really cool. I like that setup. Alright, so, yeah, on the way out to Route 2. Please stop stopping me. <laughs> Listen, Jordan, I've been thinking. If you're a Pokemon training now, you must want to try your hand at the Gym Challenge, right? Uh, I like how I have to ask what that is. The Gym Challenge, mate. Mate. The annual competition where trainers can battle it out. Uh, for the right to cha challenge the champion. But the trick is that you've got to begin doors if you want to take part, and Lee doesn't seem to think I'm up for snuff. Uh, so I'm thinking I ought to talk to the professor and see if she could help. You've got to take part two, the proper rival. A proper rival is just the thing every trainer needs to keep growing stronger, after all. Keep you motivated, right? The professor's house is way down the end of Route 2, so let's head there and give our teams a chance to train a bit along the way. Uh, my voice gets nice and tired. Alright. So yeah, let's, uh... Please. Please stop. <laughs> please just let me go and play the game. Alright, Jordan. It's time we fill our teams a bit. Oh, 
and I'm here to teach you how. You'll need to catch Pokemon if you have hope of filling up Pokedex. I've just caught two. I don't need help. Uh, only look at you, little Jordan. You've already caught someone on your own. Oh, thank you. Your mom gave me those Pokemons, did she? Pokeballs. I'll give you some more Pokeballs in return. I'll only ask that you catch plenty of Pokemon. The Pokemon around here seem easy to catch. It's almost like they're itching to join some trainer's team when you say. 20 Pokeballs? My god. <laughs> you put the Pokeballs in your bag's, bag's Pokeball pocket. <laughs> the Pokemon on your team will get EXP points when you catch Pokemon too. And of course, they'll get EXP points from battle. So take care. Uh, so take on the other trainers you meet along the path to help your Pokemon thrive. Your team will keep on changing and growing as you get stronger, no doubt. But even I don't know exactly how yet. Uh, show your champions something good. All right. Sure. Twenty Pokeballs. That's like really easy. Uh, the professor will be shocked when she sees. Okay. <laughs> uh, hello. Pokemans. What are you? Oh, I don't like you. I don't like you at all. Nope. Mm -mm. Not that one. Don't want it. But I gotta catch it anyways. But don't want it. <laughs> well, actually, I don't have to catch it, do it. I guess I do. <laughs> It's probably not going to be hurt much by that, but... Eh, not the worst thing. What type is it? Is it like... I guess grass type? I don't know. Let's catch it. I guess the only way to learn, eh? I'm not sure if it's properly low enough, but... We'll see. One, two, three. There we go. Blip bug was caught. Hate bugs. <laughs> he gained XP and uh, Squavit has leveled up. It's a beautiful lake. Beautiful. Uh, add to the puppy. Oh, so bug top. I didn't remember that bug was the top for some reason. Uh, for some reason, I thought it was grass. I considered a grass top. Alright. So that's just a bunch of Squavits. That looks new. Unless it's exactly what. <laughs> a tootle. Oh, it's like a tortoise, but blue. I need it. Pound. With a human face, though. I'm not, I'm not sure how I feel about it fully, but I might still take it. Alright. Looks like my camera's like up and out of the way of most things, so I think that's good. I think I chose the right spot all in all. Uh, let me know if it's been in the way of anything and I just haven't noticed at this point. If so, I could just maximize it and then not show the game. That'd be good, right? Alright, let's see if we can catch this one. He might be a little bit... Oh no, I've, I've caught a lot on a lot higher of health. The lower... Yeah, higher of health. I'll break that thing. There we go. No one too bad. Not too shabby. And we'll probably get someone leveling up. Yep, nick it. And uh, learn to beat up, so it's pretty cool. So there we go. We'll be added to the Pokédex, and there's a water type Pokémon. Uh, no nickname needed. Thank you, though. What was that? Is that another nick it? I believe so. Oh, no. Another one of those. I do not like that. Nope. <laughs> Not a fan. Uh, let's go ahead. Oh, there was a quicker way to just bring out stuff. I didn't realize. What is bond? Oh, I didn't realize it was an actual attack. Okay. That's pretty powerful, honestly. Um. Oh. Oh, so it's a continuing one. Interesting. That's cool to know. Um... Let's try... Let's try a water gun, see if that... I can't remember how much damage that did before. Pretty good, okay. So I think I'm okay. I'll need to use a potion. Uh, probably next. I might take him out, actually. Yeah. <laughs> well, that was a good one. I didn't realize that Bond was so... So good. And I guess because I had him in my Pokédex. That I knew his weaknesses, so that came up to tell me. 
Okay, I can use a bit of hand holding. I'm okay with that. Uh, so let's go ahead and um, we'll go ahead and use a potion here. There we go. That's better. Um, do we have any? What's this? Adventure guide and fishing rod to fish up various kinds of or er, va various kinds of Pokemon. You can fish up Pokemon. Where's the water? <laughs> Let me add it. That's amazing. Oh, looks like a trainer. Uh, yes, school, school, school boy Roy. That's what we call him. Can't say it very well, but that's what his name is. It's common manners for Pokemon trainers to battle when their eyes meet. Well, I haven't looked into your eyes. Uh, youngster Jake. Jake Paul? No. Uh, youngster Jake sent out school wobbits. Go, Swoople. <laughs> Alright. Let's go ahead and... Let's do Bond. That was pretty cool. I like some lasting damage. Yeah, just a... It's like just a little tickle at first and then... Woo! It'll get you. So you be pretty... Pretty decent there. I think if I use... I mean, I think Water Gun's more efficient than Pound there for sure. So I'll use that. There we go, that's fairly low. Also, apologies for sniffing. My nose has been a bit funky today. I think uh, the winter weather is starting to affect me. But at least I don't have to go outside anymore. There's Pokemon to be played, so that's good. There we go. Wait, did he only have one? I didn't actually check. Uh, gained the XP. Leveled up. We're level 9 now. Uh, level 5. I like that the EXP shares already on. That's always nice. Wow. Everyone, yeah, I had 4 level ups. Meowth is level 6. I can't believe I have a Meowth. That still gets me. Uh, wow. Whenever there's a strong trainer, I always look right at them. <laughs> Alright. So. Um, definitely not that up there. Yeah. I like how you can see the Pokemon and kind of avoid them, kind of not. At the same time, like... You can decide just what you want to do. Uh, I mean, I'm just very curious about kind of getting to where I want to be. But at the same time, I'm curious about, you know, exploring. And obviously getting these would be fantastic. Um, which I guess really it's not a bad idea to, you know, get them up. I don't have it yet, so I feel like getting the owl. Uh, Rookity would be a good idea. Um... I'm going, ooh, level seven. That's pretty good, actually. I'm gonna just start out with water gun, see how that does. I imagine, yeah, pretty effective. And then peg, it's probably gonna hurt a lot. Yeah. Sima. Uh, so I'll use this one more time, and then I should be able to just go ahead and capture him. Ooh, I thought that was gonna get him for a second. I was like, ooh, that's gonna be bad, isn't it? Oh, nope. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be a lot worse than it was. Alright, so I can just, I like that you can just use Pokeballs from that, that's a lot easier. So, I still did this weird thing, which you can kind of see, I hold A and B at the same time. I was told, like, 20 years ago that that was a good thing to do, and it helped you get a better chance when playing on the Game Boy Advance, or, not even the Game Boy Advance, it was the Game Boy, playing Pokemon Yellow, or the Pikachu Edition, or whatever you want to call it, and, like, told that it was helpful. I think I learned it on, like, Game FAQs in, like, not too 90 something and I still do it to this day just out of habit. I don't think it makes any difference, but I'm still doing it. <laughs> uh, we can send him... I'm actually gonna put him in my... Actually, no, I don't wanna put him in the party. Well, maybe I do. I will trade him for probably as much as I love Choodle. It's so cute. Uh, well, it's kinda. The face is weird. I'm not sure how I feel about the face. I like the fact it's like a turtle, but that's about it. But uh, I feel like having a flying top Pokemon is going to be more beneficial than that. I just whistled, but... Okay, if you press that, you whistle, BT Dubs. Uh, so there's another one of those. Um, there was another... Oh, okay, it's a little squirrel. Let's just go ahead and battle. Cute and strong, together in combination. That's what I call myself. Cute and strong. Last Lauren. Alright. 
Uh, sin out tutor, <laughs> of course, yeah. Uh, I mean, Sobble's not going to be my best bet for this one, is it? But, what level is it? Level 6? Uh, I could switch Pokemon. That wouldn't be such a bad idea. Um, ooh, dark type Pokemon. I thought it was a fire Pokemon. Ooh. Uh, let's try out the Meowth. He's like the same level, so it could be a bit... <clears throat> could be a bit sketchy, but I'm sure we're fun. Excuse me again, by the way. <laughs> again, not for them. 100%. Alright. Do some tackle. Oh, really effective. That's great. Uh, so fake out is effective. Slash is effective. Payday effective. Let's do fake out. Oh, he's in the original Pokemon series. Oh, he can't move. That's great. In the original Pokemon series, uh, I really, really loved Meowth. Like that Team Rocket. So I still always think about that every single time that I see Meowth. Uh, what's Payday? I know it's a good candy bar, but... Oh! That was amazing, I love that. <laughs> Coins are scattered everywhere. Alright, she have more than one Pokemon, or is that it? I think I might have been it. There we go, we got to level up for Squawpa and Sobble. Level 10 on Sobble now. Defeated last Lauren. Oh, she's sad. Are we cute and nothing more? It looks like our strength still has a way to go. Got 504 Pokebucks. That's what we'll call it. Wait, was that something for coins dropping? I wasn't sure if that's what that said or not. But if so, very neat. So I guess this little creeper. <laughs> I couldn't beat Hop, then I'm gonna beat you. Hopefully you went to the Poke stop, because otherwise you're just going down one hit. Youngster Benjamin. Uh bug. I hate that name. So old Sobble comes out first, which I wonder if his health restored. No, it did not, but I'll still go with it. Let's do Water Gun. I think being five levels above, I'm probably fun. Wow. That was intense. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's not really touching me much, is it? Um, let's actually use Pound. I didn't look at how effective that was. Eh, I mean, I guess anything was effective at that, like, health level. There we go. Meowth is leveled up now. <laughs> so much leveling. I guess especially in this earlier ages. Uh, yeah, I will switch Pokemon actually. I will switch. I didn't see who it was going to, but I'm gonna try. Uh, make it because I really want to see the, the Dark Top Pokemon. I didn't realize that I had one so quickly. So it's really cool. Oh, It's kind of like Rapidash and Nine Tails together. Oh. I didn't realize he had the same thing. That's awkward. Well, I guess I'm using quick tech. <laughs> well, that's awkward. So he got me down to 18. I'm going to say that I'll probably get him down to like 17. Oh, let me switch. This isn't going to go well. Uh, oh, it automatically tells you like what's good. Oh, super effective. Okay, let's do that. Let's swap Pokemon to that. Maybe it come back. And then we got Blip Bug. So having a bug type Pokemon, so Bug is very effective against, like super effective against uh, Dark type, which is great. And I'm gonna go ahead and use a Potion uh, on Blip Bug, because he's pretty low. I think it's the Heat. Uh, yeah. There we go. HP restored, so they're going to use Tail Whip, so I think that's defense going down, which is fine. And then I'll just use my one thing called Struggle Bug. And uh, hopefully, take him out pretty easy here. It'd be great if it takes him out in like one hit, but. Oh, okay, so it's going to be two hits and gone. And I think his defense, oh no, speed attack. Uh, or speed of attack, I guess is what it is. Or it's a special attack. I don't actually remember. One of the two. Is that even a special attack? But there we go, super effective. Alright, and... Use this again. He's only using Tiller, which is very odd, since he should have, like, Bot or something, I would assume. Alright, there we go. Took it out. It's fainted. That should be in good XP as well, because the battle took a little bit longer. Seems like that helps sometimes. And there we go, another level up for three of our guys. Uh, Blipbo, Lickety, and 
Nick lit. Nick it. Keep saying Nick lit. Nick is lit. Fam. Or lose to wild Pokemon. Lose to mini trainers. Got 420 for winning. Blades. All right. And off to just seeing if there's anything special there. Not really. And here we go. Look, there's the professor. Aw, she's old. So have you unraveled the secrets of the Dimax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness, no, the whole thing is still full of questions. I had hoped that my granddaughter would take over my research, but... That's just right. Hello. Dear me, I'm sorry, I didn't even notice my guest. My name's Jordan. My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. That's what she sounds like. I promise. <laughs> Why hop, dear? I uh, see who has made some new friends. And you must be Jordan. I trust you received the Pokedex of Sonya. I'm sure you have it complete in no time. You must already know about the Dynamaxing Rot Jordan? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Easy. <laughs> Professor Magnolia has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years. And it takes proper understanding of the if you the, of the thing if you plan to use Dynamax to the fullest. There you go again, Leon. Always talking about Pokemon. There are other things worth knowing about too, like how many different types of tea there are. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Professor, do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee to in, uh, you sh he should endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Leon, why wouldn't you endorse them? Hop and Jordan only just started out as Pokemon trainers. They still have loads they don't know yet. Dearie, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Gauntlet region to become my strong trainers, isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. That goes precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. <laughs> right then, in case, how about this? Let's see if the two of you can show me a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure both of your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. Okay. Wow, so like a full, full battle. Right, I'll be waiting outside, Jordan. Jordan, c'est quoi? That's my name, by the way. Full name. Uh, hurry it up, Jordan. Uh, you've got to battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. Okay. <laughs> uh, do I just take my side? Do I just talk to you, maybe? I want to become the greatest Pokemon trainer there is. And to do that, I need that endorsement to take part in that gym challenge. Come at me with everything you've got so I can prove the lead that we've got what it takes. Oh, I did it. I mean, I, I guess I'm about as good as I can go. I have a fairly varied team. My levels isn't the worst in the world. So, you know, I'm rather interested to see how you two young trainers battle too. There we go. I got where it's at. I'm not dumb. Listen, you two, the reason I'm unbeatable is because I learned from every battle I see or take. Pardon. <laughs> That's how I've gotten to where I am today, so show me something good in this battle. I'm all teacher, I think, too, because I've played Pokemon for over 20 years. I don't know much. It's time for the legend to begin. Yep. Me. <laughs> yeah, loosen up that throwing shoulder. I'm challenged by Hop. Hopscotch. Alright. Oh, Sub. He only has three Pokemon. Oh, you did not go well. Alright. Yeah, hopefully. Oh, you did not get that much slower, did you? Oh, I'm gonna use Bond first. I don't know how, uh... Oh, it avoided. Wow. Didn't expect that. I did not see that coming. Oh, I see the light is actually... I just saw the shadow on my screen. <laughs> it's, uh, actually from a microphone on the way. That makes sense. Alright, use water gun. Ooh, yeah, it's gonna make pretty quick work. Just doing that twice, isn't it? Alright. Use water gun. There we go. One bat for the dust. That means he only caught one Pokemon. <laughs> I just realized. Uh, oh, hop. Uh, no, I'll just keep my current Pokemon. I mean, it's pretty good one to have for this. But, super effective. And uh, I didn't see what level it was. Level 8. Almost killed it in one hit. A KO day, I guess. Learn your top matchups. I mean, I didn't do much of anything. I just pressed buttons, you know. I've used the same attack for like four times in a row. <laughs> That's all I'm doing here. 
That's why Pokemon's great. <laughs> Thanks, dude. KO. Uh, we are level 11 now, which is crazy. Uh, learned Home Claws. Level 9 for Rookity. I think we're, we're going pretty well, so he's about to send out Rookity. You know what, I'm gonna see if I can just beat him all with one Pokemon. <laughs> just if I was like... Just if that's like, fine. Because if that's fine, oh lord. Level 5 Rookity. What did you do? <laughs> Wait, what did you say? I didn't read what that actually said. Nah, I'm just doing this. <laughs> I didn't read what it actually said. Wow, I nearly just took it out one hit. Alright. Let's, um... Oh, I didn't mean to use Bond, actually. But it might be enough, honestly. It was. That's sad. Oh, no. Well, it happens. It happens to the worst of us, you know? Uh, Meowth wants to learn Scratch at Old Moon. Yeah, I think for getting something for Scratch would be good. Um, I can't think of one time I've actually used Growl in my life, to be honest. <laughs> uh, okay, so this one's 40 and 100. Payday's also 40 and 100. I have more of this, so I mean, that seems pretty... I mean, the money being earned after the battle is pretty cool, though. I'm not sure how much money I truly need. 40 and 100. It works and makes them flinch. It works with the first turn each time it use it. Okay. It only works the first time each time the user enters battle. And that is pretty handy, so I think I'd... Hey, how often do I need... I, like, how often do I really need that? So, there we go. I mean, the like 20 coins I earned isn't going to be that special. All in all, so I think I'm bad. All right, I defeated him. Oh no! Uh, oof, got it at that loss. But I expect nothing less of my rival. Six forty for winning. That's right. <laughs> I even got my Pokeball throw perfect too. It doesn't seem like you did. You caught one. <laughs> the sting of defeat and the joy of victory. I guess that going through both is the key to getting the two of us stronger, right? Heck yeah. <laughs> Hello, Leon. Nice pants. Jordan Hop. Well, after seeing a match like that one, I suppose I've got little choice to give you both an endor endorse endorsement as champion. Really, you should just give it to me. Your brother's terrible. Just saying. Oh, that was a rough one. Thank you for the air. Uh, you've attained a letter of endorsement. You put the letter of endorsement in your key items pocket. Ah, look at that. Yes, thanks, Lee. I swear I'm going to win my way through the gym challenge to reach you. You may both be uh, young still and plenty rough around the edges, but that was a proper battle. Charizard and I were both feeling that excitement in every last cell in our bodies. Hop, you've always tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokeball out. Things like that have nothing to do with real strength. Honestly, I'd be worried about you still obsessing over that sort of nonsense, but it seems like you've really grown a bit, little brother. Widow Butter. And I'd like to see some more thrilling Pokemon battles out of you two, Jordan. You just didn't have anything to say to me, did you? Or is it just because you used the same Pokemon? <laughs> you and me are going to train up against uh, train up against one another and aim for that champion's title. Uh, sure, absolutely. The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokemon will grow. Huh? What's that? What? <laughs> uh, oh. Interesting. Yes, run towards the thing that fell out of the sky and pick it up off the ground. That's always a good idea. Jordan, would you look at this? They're wishing stars. Since there are two of them, you should take one yourself. You have attained a wishing star. Put it in your key items. A stone found in the Galore region with mysterious power. It said that one of your dreams will come true if you find one. With one of these Pokemon, uh, my Pokemon can Dynamax, and they're going to be massive. Yes. Oh, yeah, the big boy. Interesting. Trust you to pull something like this. They say wishy starts fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart, you know. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the tra greatest trainer ever. He's just louder and louder about it, to be honest. There, I've said it three times. Surely my wish will come true now, right? No. Don't be silly, Hop. Those wishy stars are composed of a curious 
sword of rock containing unknown power. They are only one. They are one of the most precious resources we have in the Galar region. But they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me now, and I'll have you sorted. All right. You've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon, haven't you, Professor? Then please give Jordan and me the power to Dynamax our Pokemon. First, we got a battle against the mad Pokemon in the slumbering world, and now this. It really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your excitement, young man, but don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. What's tomorrow's journey? <laughs> Hello. Seems I came back uh, home around time for all this excitement. Hello. Hey, you lot. Why don't we have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making the latest trendy curries. Oh, yes. I love some trendy curries. My favorite thing in the world. <sighs> now what? My screen's all dark. Okay. Uh, it's like, please don't crash. Because I've heard that have so many times I've played Switch. It's morning at last, and time for our adventure to truly start. Good morning to you, young challengers. Hop, is it true you met some Pokemon you didn't recognize? Uh, is there anything more you could tell me about it? Looks like a shield. Or, well, there was a weird heavy fog, and then this even weirder Pokemon appeared. Jordan tried to fight it off, but I think we both passed out or something. It's all pretty hazy. A right fount of information you are. <laughs> Jordan, Hop, these are for you. I like a cane. It's got a chicken thing on it. Oh, a sweat band. You got a Dynamax band from your professor, from Professor Magnolia and slipped on your wrist. Whisked. Perfect. A wishing star has been affixed to it. It lets a lot out that allows a Pokemon to Dynamax when, it, when at a power spot. Okay. <laughs> These are your Dynamax bands. I made them by finding the wishing stars you had and fa uh, you had found wishing stars you found last night in those two of those bands. Sometimes my reading just goes all over the place. Thanks, Professor. This is brilliant. It's just like the one Lee has on him, too. Now we can Dynamax our Pokemon like he does. My word, you don't waste time, do you? I think you'll find it's not so simple as that. There are a number of conditions you must meet and hope uh, if you hope to have your Pokemon Dynamax and take on gigantic form. Now, don't be afraid to go to all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon. That will help you fill out your Pokedex, too. The Legend of My Reign is finally about to begin. <laughs> Come on, Jordan. I'll beat you to the station. Why is it always a race with you, you know? Can we just relax? Look at that cute thing in the bottom left corner. You know, that's good. Web server press Y. Uh, link trade. Wycombe offers you... Oh. Ran out of breath. <laughs> Wycombe offers many ways to connect with other players. You'll be welcome to swap Pokemon, take part in Pokemon battles, and more. There's never a shortage of things to do. When stamps arrive in the walk home while you're out on your adventure, that means other trainers are around looking for someone to connect with. Press the Y button to see who's around. Normally, you can use walk home to connect with people close by, but if you press the plus button and connect to the internet, you'll be able to connect with people around the world. Select a stamp that shows the silhouette of a Pokemon on it, and you'll be able to team up with your fellow trainers to battle Pokemon. Okie dokie. Surprise trade? No. <laughs> Link battle profile. So I guess that's like what I can choose. I mean, I don't want that guy. Look at him. He's just creepy. Um, I mean, oh, oh, Pikachu. Oh, Eevee. Oh, I mean, clearly you just gotta have Pikachu as my thing, you know? That's perfect. Why didn't that work? Confirm. Change it. <laughs> uh,. So, surprise trade lets you trade Pokemon in a truly surprising way. Select a Pokemon to trade and leave the rest up to us. A trading partner just trade. Okay. I mean, I'm willing to trade someone. Um, what happens if I wanted to trade? Let's just say we want to trade the Choodle. Uh, yeah, let's select him. Would you like to save your game and start a surprise trade? Yes. <laughs> Starting to search for another trainer. You can also cancel your request by selecting another option from the menu. Okay. So it's searching. We'll see if we get anything. Take a drink while it searches. Hmm. Oh, you can actually play and do stuff. Well, that's nice at least. Whee! What's in your house? Oh. 
the one I'm trading. And I guess her husband, though. Uh, can I go upstairs? Oh, you can. Hello. <laughs> Let me just check out your room. <laughs> I don't mean to be creepy, but here I am. Hello. Nice makeup, <laughs> I guess. Everything you need for the latest trendy makeup looks. I love the word trendy, that's for sure. It's very trendy. <laughs> Got him. Um, okay, so yeah, nothing yet, but that's fine. So search stamps. Oh, I see. That makes sense. So what happens if I do... What's the plus button? That's the plus button. I'm not an old man, don't worry. Uh, <laughs> don't know where things are. You are now connected to the internet. I was just curious if things popped up better, but no, it doesn't seem like... I was curious if anything changed, but it seems to be about the same. Okay. Interesting. But... Uh, that's gonna be it for this episode because it's already an hour and 30 minutes long. Uh, that's what happens, I guess, when you just end up talking for forever. But, uh, yeah, that's gonna be it for now. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, it was a lot of fun. Um, have a little whistle. Someone's near me. Oh, wait, trade complete. I gotta see what that is. So, I, I sent it to Zeroi. Goodbye. I wonder who I'm getting in return. <gasps> a little bird. <laughs> oh, I got over something in not English. I don't know what language that is. Yay. <laughs> I'm going to have to rename you. Piddov. Oh, I love you. That is so cool. So, I now... In the... Oh, thing. I now, in theory, uh, Pokedex. Nope, that's still not what I needed, actually. Pokemon. Pokemon. Uh, wait, are they not here? Or do I just need to swap them to be able to see them? Um, I don't know. How do I see my extras? I don't know. I probably read something that I need, or like, had something that I probably need to read. Um,. Well, let's see, there's like oh, so fun, some fun things here. Oh, I can do it where I don't have to give them. That's easier. That saved me a lot of time. <laughs> because I never give them, so it's fun. Um, I wanted to look at stuff as well. I forgot to look. Uh, okay. Oh, there's like casual controls. What does that mean? Just play with one hand. Oh, that's kind of nice, actually. Skip movies. No. Okay, so... Interesting. Yeah, I mean, I don't have the gyroscope like ability because I'm using other things, but still. And, um. But no, uh, that's interesting. Yeah, I don't know where my little pigeon would be. I don't know if he ends up in, uh. Oh, oh, so it's. Oh, there's suggestions of what's in an area. So I've seen 10 on the car. I guess that makes sense. Just because, I mean, it's like, I guess it's in my area, so. Yeah, it's got like a bit of hand holding, but that's mighty fine by me. Um, I'm not complaining. So let's press B. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and save. So save my progress now. As you can see, I've been playing for an hour and 16 now. But, anyways, like I said, that's it for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Let me know if you want more. And goodbye.